day. Well, it's Saturday afternoon, and we're heading out. Now, I think Friday, we talked about good stress, bad stress. And, you know, it's important to find a positive medium. So, you need to be aware of your health, and that can be a negative stress, and especially the brittle. So, you know, to combat some of these negative stress, you've got to get out. You've got to get out and do something social. That's important. So for me, it's coffee with old people. Now, first of all, a lot of you are going to think, well, that title, you know, it's relatively demeaning. And but let me explain what Coffee with Old People is. Coffee with Old People is a group of people. And, you know, we've met for a long time. And, you know, it's just a way of getting out and talking over things. Now, they're not all diabetics. You know, you could do this with a diabetic group. You can do a lot of things. But you need to always get out and, my God, have some fun. Because, you know, people who sit there and don't have any fun and don't do anything except look after their blood sugars and that become a very boring individual. You know, it could be getting out, going with friends, going on a camping trip. Don't let diabetes win. And that's part of it. You've got to be able to go out. You know, you can go out and do almost anything that you liked before. But, but don't feel that you have to be in your home all the time and have a nurse watching you. and Because that doesn't work as well. Now, besides coffee with old people, I also, every night, sit with the other dog owners in the building. We just chat and have a fun time. But you need to remember, you are important and you should be out. If you like sports, go out and, I don't know, bowling or... No, just get away from diabetes for a while. Now, that doesn't mean you don't take your blood sugars, don't do anything along those lines. But what I'm saying... Just one sec here. Nico's pulling... Nico's pulling the chair. There we go. Hold on. Excuse me. Sorry about that. So, you need to... Conquer your social. Get out there. You know, you can go out to dinner. You can, you know, do some something fun in your life. Because I know it's very easy to get tied up with the diabetes thing. The diabetes regimen. Oh, you've got to eat it this time. Oh, you've got to take your blood sugar. And it can be a real pain. So... Don't let it become a real pain. And part of that is getting out and doing something social. I'm just on a path now, so. If you don't, you know, you're, people are going to think that, oh, well, He's a diabetic. He can't do anything. I'll be right back after I get off this path. 
So, I'm going to take you down and we're going to have fun and just a few laughs and relax. You know, it's coffee. It's not rocket science. So, huh? insert some things in SkyTrain and buses and everything that we go on. So I'll see you. It's easy to, otherwise you're just going to keep thinking about your diabetes day and night. Have a good night. Bye.